Good afternoon, Laura Pinsky. Hi. Hi. Eurovision Weekend Berlin. Under the sun, we are one. Yeah, it fits. Right now, it's very shiny and warm. So under the sun, we are one. It really feels like we're in the middle of Europe. Yeah. With this sunshine, beautiful day in yeah. July. Um, so far, good weekend. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I uh, saw a lot of Berlin, and it's such a beautiful city. And uh, I met these amazing people from the ESC club, and uh, it really has been an amazing weekend so far. Yeah. 2006, um, oh, 2016, that's how old I am. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 2006 has been a good year for you. Um, you were selected for the German national final at mm -hmm. Eurovision. Tell us about the experience. It was such a huge experience for me because I am just 19 and to stand on this huge stage and to get this huge audience to watch me, it was just unbelievable. I mean, I can't believe it until today. It's just like a dream. What's the best moment about being part of that national selection process with the NDR? Wow. Well, there are a lot of moments. I mean, uh, probably the greatest is like to stand on that stage or like when you're going on that stage, it's such a special moment because you have to you have to save all the energy and you know that you are going there. You have uh, like to sing in front of a million people or you don't have to, but you want to, you'd love to. and. Uh, that's probably like the greatest moments, like really just to go up there and to do it and to see all those people and to look in their faces, yeah. You've worked with Ralf Siegel this year, not to forget him, and uh, he's, he's a superstar at Eurovision. Did, were, you fa were you familiar with Ralf before you worked together? Um, I have to admit that I didn't know uh, Ralf before. I was like, he sent me an email and he said, I want to meet you, I want to work with you, and I was like, who is that? <laughs> I was like, I, I asked my mom and she was like, Laura, it's such a huge producer from Germany. <laughs> and I was like, oopsie. <laughs> no, I have, I have to admit that I didn't know his name, like his person, um, but I definitely knew his songs. And uh, from Ein bisschen Frieden to Genghis Khan, I uh, knew them all and I know them all, but I just didn't know him as a person. Yeah. How is it to work with Ralf? It was amazing. It's just such a pleasure to work with such an experienced person and uh, yeah it's really such a huge thing for a little girl like me yeah are you disappointed you didn't make it through this year no i'm not i have to admit that i was it was just such a pleasure to get into the 10 people that are in the pre-selection i mean they are they were like over 100 people that sent their songs there and to get just into that 10 was such a big thing and uh, just to stand on that stage and uh, yeah to be seen by millions of people was amazing so you study law i heard yeah that's quite different to music isn't mm, it <laughs> yeah it is but i think like it's a good thing to have a second like bass and I think law isn't that bad. <laughs> so what do your, your fellow students think of you studying law and also singing? Do, do, do you have a lot of friends knowing about uh, your song career so far, your singing career? Uh, yeah, I have like a group, like my, fr like my three friends, so we are like a group of four, but uh, they're definitely also others that probably know that I was in the ESC because uh, I also was on the radio at the university and it was uh, really cool to get to know it because I didn't know we have such a thing. But um, they are all supporting me and they, uh, yeah, they are really supportive. How do you spend your free time? We know you've got a dog. Yeah. Nala! Yeah, Nala! <laughs> yeah, that's We like dog. animals. <laughs> I love animals, I love animals. My dog is crazy, but uh, so cute. And uh, <laughs> yeah, she's really a little bit crazy, but um, I think that makes her special. And in my free time, I'm just like every other teenage girl. I'm just singing. I don't know, I listen to music, I'm meeting my friends, I'm going out, uh, just that stuff, yeah. Yeah, so last but not least, Eurovision. Are you going to try it another time? I would love to, let's see. Would it be for Germany? I don't know. I'm very open for that. Why not Poland? <laughs> why not? I, I, why not? I don't know. I would do it, definitely. Yeah. Good. Any country? Uh, I, I, 
which country I would choose if I had the or what um, I don't know I probably like I have I have the most relation to uh, Germany and Poland so that would be probably like my two favorites um, but I'm very open for it um, I would do it for Spain for Sweden <laughs> Laura, it's been an absolute pleasure speaking with you under the sun of Berlin yeah. and wishing you the very best for your career. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me.